After the victory of the Islamic Revolution and the people's vote for an Islamic Republic, a few small groups which had been disappointed began sabotaging against the new government. One of them was the Forgan group, which in a short time assassinated many key political figures. Murtaza Mutahari, a member of the Council of the Islamic Revolution, Muhammad Wali Qarani, commander of the Joint Staff of the Army, Muhammad Mufateh, the university and seminary professor, are among the intelligentsia assassinated by this group. They also made a failed attempt on Akbar Hashemi Rafsanjani. In total, they carried out 20 terrorist attacks, most of which were successful. Akbar Gudarzi, an unknown clergyman who had finished Islamic jurisprudence lessons incompletely, was the head of this terrorist group. He was mostly believed to be a member of the Savak, the intelligence service of the Pahlavi dynasty, and enjoyed the U.S.'s support for his operations inside Iran. Following the U.S. embassy takeover, it was revealed that it had connections with the Forgan terrorist group via third parties. Americans got the jitters because they had given financial support to it and were hopeful that this group, along with over a hundred other groups which had from 50 to 2,000 members each, would topple down the new government of Iran. Despite being highly organizational and covert, the Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps managed to capture all of its members within a year. The leaders of Forgan were executed and this in practice cut off another U.S. operative inside Iran.